Hi, this is Andy the GD Script Dude with another video in the Tetron game development series. In this video we will make a few changes to the GUI to improve the appearance of the grid and to optimize the grid script. First of all, let's narrow the gap between the tiles. We select the grid and go to Custom Constants, then set the V separation and H separation to 1 pixel. Now let's make the background color of the grid black. We can use a color rectangle node for this. Set its color to black and move it into position such that it appears behind the grid. Moving on to the GUI code, we can change the way we hide tiles. Rather than setting the color to the background of the screen, we can set their alpha value to zero, making them transparent. So, we can remove the unnecessary constants for the background colors. With Control F, we can find where the functions are and remove the color input parameter. Then use the color function to set the cell's modulate property to transparent. Run the game to see if it works. And we have a clear area on the left and a black area on the right. Now let's try to center our main scene on the window of the display. To do that we will need to have a control node for the root node. Let's change the root node to a different type and how about a center container. Center container, there we go, change. Make it fill the available window space. And there we go, it's centered. And we run our game and we get an error because the we are no longer extending Node 2D, but rather a center container. So we want to fix that. And run again. And it's working. Let's just check. Nicely centered. Okay, that's it for now. And I'll see you in the next video.